The delete all right and delete all left commands let you clear the line content to the right or left of the cursor position in VS Code. I find that this is most helpful when working with multi-cursor, but you also might make these operations part of your normal text editing workflow. Here, for example, you can see that I have my cursor in the middle of this paragraph in this markdown file. And let's say I wanted to perform one of these operations. I'm going to open up the command palette with Control shift p or Command shift p on Mac and say delete all. And you can see I have delete all right and delete all left. Now, delete all to the right is actually the one that I find myself using most often. So let's take a look at that one first. So I'm just going to trigger this using the command palette here. And you can see that it's cleared all of the content of that line um, after the cursor position to the right. Now, delete all left, as you would expect, does the same, but to the left. So I'm going to open the command palette again and say delete all left instead. And sure enough, it cleared all the line content to the left of the cursor position. So these two commands um, you can use to quickly manipulate lines. As I mentioned, I think that these are most useful with multi-cursor. So for example, let's just go to like a package.json file here, create some multiple cursors. And let's say that I wanted to just quickly delete all of the line content to the right of um, here and just completely replace all that content. I could use the delete all right command, which on Mac is bound to control K by default. There is no default key binding on Windows and Linux, but you can easily set one up if this is something you find yourself using often. So I'm just going to press control K here to do a delete all right. And then I could go in and do star or whatever I want here and just quickly update all of those entries using delete all right after clearing the line content. So that is the delete all right and delete all left commands. They can really speed up your text manipulation. And if you're on Windows and Linux, you may want to consider setting up a key binding for them so you can use them more easily.